welcome back to the final day of the seven day Coraline Ab Challenge. I am so, so proud of you for making it this far. It is an unbelievable accomplishment, especially during this difficult time. So do not underestimate what you have just accomplished and get very excited about this one last seven minute lean ab blaster with me. But before we dive into it, as always, make sure you subscribe to the channel because more challenges are coming your way and make sure you check out the link. This is the last chance to sign up for the 30 day Coraline Challenge starting on Monday, April 20th. I promise you this much, it is not only gonna transform your body, but also your mental and physical health. So do not miss out. It is more important than ever before that we come together, we're raising money to help feed those in need while we burn calories and we start feeling amazing. So do that now, and otherwise, let's dive in to today's workout where we are going to challenge you in a whole host of different ways. We're gonna go for 30 seconds on, 30 seconds on, 30 seconds on, so this is the longest stint we've done, but I really wanna throw everything at you. I just want you to do your best, and then we get an active recovery stretch mobility for 30 seconds, and we repeat until seven minutes is over. So first exercise we're gonna do is hand to toe touch for 30 seconds, and then after that's done, we're gonna go into plank hold, and from there on, you just listen up to me, follow me, do your best as always, and get excited that you're doing another seven minute Coraline workout with me. So in three, Two, one, it is time to get Coraline with it. We're rocking back, touching that opposite toe, sinking at the hips, and as you can see, I hope you realize throughout the last seven days how I really like to train and challenge your body. I don't believe in doing isolated movements all the time. I feel like you waste a ton of time, you're not as efficient, and you simply don't get the best results. Here we like to do full body movements, Three, two, one, we're going into a plank. Now really challenge your whole body in that way. That's how you get that lean, toned look as well as increase your strength. I am just as strong as I was when I was a professional rugby player. I train far less. I have twins and toddler, all this different stuff. And it is really amazing what you can accomplish right here from your living room. So I want you to make sure you understand that and get really excited about the fact that you can make all this kind of progress. In five seconds, we're gonna flip onto our back and go to heel touches. Two, one, here we go. Nice and quick, just heel touches, crunching down. You can see these transitions are really fast. We're not wasting a ton of time. We're gonna keep moving and keep working that core. Come on, keep pushing, keep pushing. There we go. Come on, keep going. We've got eight seconds to go. Reach down, squeeze those obliques. Two, one, rest. Now, we're gonna go into a downward dog. This is just like an active stretch, so it's here. And I want you to sink at the hips, really bend that back, wiggling side to side, and you're gonna feel your core stretch as well. And then push back, feeling your calves, come through one last time, catch your breath. The next exercise we're gonna to go to in 10 seconds is sit-ups, okay? So we're gonna do sit-ups, pause there, get ready for your sit-ups in five seconds. Three, hands on head, two, one, here we go, 30 seconds of sit-ups. Now if the sit-up is too hard, I want you to go to crunches, and in 20 seconds time, we're actually going to go to reverse crunches. So our hands are gonna go behind our butt, our knees are bent, and we're bringing those knees toward our face. 10 seconds to go. Keep getting those reps in. Come on, five seconds. Three, two, one, hands behind butt. You can see my knees are just bent and I bring them towards my face, lifting my lower back off the mat. And it's just a reverse crunch here. Really works our lower abdomen area. And after this, we're gonna sit on our butts and go to Russian twist, okay? So twisting side to side. You can have your feet on the ground if you're starting to get pretty fatigued. Three, two, one, Russian twist. Here we go. So we're just going side to side, really taxing our obliques. Come on, exaggerate that twist. Uh, come on, we're at nearly the halfway mark. We're gonna get another recovery active stretch. Uh, 15 seconds to go. Come on, push with me. 10 seconds. Uh, come on. Five, push, push, push. Three, two, one, wow. Uh, okay, we're gonna go to 
calf stretch here. Wow, squatties, I'm so proud. Just rocking it out here for 30 seconds. Our next hold, our next move, I'm gonna show you in about 10 seconds here is a plank rock. We're actually gonna alternate side plank sides continuously for 30 seconds. So you guys keep stretching. Watch me, I'm gonna start here, and then I roll over, hold for a second, roll over, hold for a second. Two, one, here we go. Just like that, rolling, working the arms, and working the core. You're not trying to go a million miles an hour. You're trying to stay nice and stable. It's just really taxing our entire core, which is what we want. Ha. And I hope, like I said in the intro, you really come to appreciate and understand how exciting we can make training just from our living room without any weights. We're gonna hold the side plank, two, one, for 30 seconds now. On our right side, or whatever side you stomp on, just hold it for 30 seconds. Then we're gonna go to the other side and hold it for 30 seconds. And I'll flip down there so you can still see me. So my back's not to you, but otherwise you just roll over. You can have your back to me. I'll count you through it. Come on, 10 more seconds. Hip nice and high. And squatters, please, again, check out the 30 day core lean challenge. In three, two, one, other side, quick switch. There we go. I promise you it is going to be an unbelievably motivating time. We're gonna have a private text group with all the squatties where we're gonna motivate each other, hold each other accountable, uh, really push one another. We're gonna be training together five times a week from our living rooms, from our bedrooms, wherever it is, and really making progress that way, as well as recovery sessions, Zoom calls throughout the month. Three, two, one, rest. Awesome work. Now. We're just gonna have our hands on the ground. This is a recovery session. The next one we're gonna do is the longest plank hold we've done all seven days. We're gonna go for a minute. If you wanna carry on after that minute, please, please, please be my guest here. I'm just pushing my butt back, hands in the ground, really stretching out my lats and my upper back. In eight seconds, we're going into a plank hold. I want you to do your best. If you have to finish it on your knees, that's okay. Two, one, here we go, squatties. Plank hold. So. But squeezing those glutes, everything is nice and tight. Here we go. Come on. We've got this. 15 seconds to go. I want you guys to push. 10 seconds to go. Come on, come on, come on. Sorry, no, I lied to you. That was the first half of it. Keep pushing now. Now you have 30 seconds to go to get to the end of this workout. Remember, if you want to continue the challenge, I want you to keep on going. This whole seven days is all about pushing you. Whether you're a beginner and you, can't, you couldn't get through the first few workouts, that is okay. Whether you're a veteran and you smashed them easily, it doesn't matter. The whole purpose is for you to challenge yourself in this difficult time. And I know these completely transformed my day. Five seconds to go. Three, two, one. Yes, squatties. If you're continuing, way to go. Holy smokes. That is the official end of the seven day core lean challenge. I'm so proud of you guys. Squatties, if you haven't already checked out the seven day original core lean challenge where it's 20 minute workouts for seven days, all hit style, really challenge your entire body from your upper body to lower body. It is exciting stuff. Make sure you check that. Make sure you subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any more leanness coming your way. And lastly, again, make sure you check out the 30 day core lean challenge. I promise you, I promise you from the bottom of my heart, it is going to be unbelievable motivating. And again, I'm so proud of each and every one of you for smashing this squatty. So I'll see you back here uh, for next, next time. Hopefully it's the 30 day core lean challenge. Way to go.